everyone in the building, but it's all about the lyricists right now. What's happening? So we're going to talk about head, head honchos in the game. Mm -hmm. And first thing come to mind, as soon as you hear their names, you tell me what you think. First head honcho that come to mind, of course, we just talked about not too long ago, 50 Cent. Businessman. Businessman? A great businessman. This guy knows how to get a check. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, you know, whether it's music, film. That's true. Uh, freaking, what is he doing? The Street Kings, Energy Drink, you got those vitamin water. TV show, that's how. Yeah. Power. Power. Yeah. Great show. Mm -hmm. I mean, just a complete well round, well minded uh, business guy. He, he knows what he's doing. Okay. Um, the young, young Money, ca Cash Money, uh, Young Money Boss, I should say, Cash Money Artist, uh, Lil Wayne. Um, definitely talented. Um, look at him as a leader, you know, he, he has a lot of artists that he's brought on to that team. It's like every day they, have, every day they have a new member. This is true. <laughs> you know, so, he does find talent. I give him that. You know, the fact that he's able and willing to create that opportunity for others, mm -hmm. um, definitely say a leader and a provider and um, one of the more talented uh, rappers in the game. Okay. Um, and another bona fide leader. Uh, of course, he's been leading for a long time, but of course, somebody I looked up as my business mentor, of course, Jay Z. Oh, Jay. Mm -hmm. I mean, hands down, Jay's the best. Um, Why is he from Brooklyn? That's a fact. <laughs> That's a fact. Whole <laughs> <laughs> big. So, um, from taking, from expanding his empire, you know, mm -hmm. from music to the liquor brand mm -hmm. to the cologne, mm -hmm. clothing, Real film as well. Uh, owner of an NBA team, mm -hmm. I mean, just about expansion and coming from Brooklyn, coming from the projects, mm -hmm. you know, he has one of the greatest stories, you know, in the game right now. Okay. So where he is, right, sitting on the empire. Right? And in the last boss, and I would say he recently became a boss because now he's starting Dreamville Records. Dreamville Records has been around for a while, but he's starting to really branch it out now. Um, what was considered Jay-Z's protege, J. Cole. J. Cole. Um, hmm. Definitely a, a, a hard worker. Another great lyricist. Mm -hmm. uh, somebody who I like to listen to his music because he tells stories as well. Mm -hmm. You get an idea of where this, where this kid came from, where he grew up, what his house was like. Mm -hmm. he, he gives you that in his songs. Um, and with his uh, imprint, Train Road Records, putting other artists on as well. So again, just following the formula, Jay-Z gave him a hand. Now he's extending that hand for others. Mm -hmm. So. Now, as 